We are today launching the budget for the City Council's expenditure for 2011-12, starting in just over six or seven weeks' time. It has been an exercise that has been challenging as we have faced significant cuts in our available funds of about £200 million. This is unknown in this generation, but we have been working on it for some 15 months and the budget that we are presenting now hopefully reflects those efforts and our concerns for the services of the citizens of Birmingham. We are facing financial challenges like everyone in the country and we have had to review the services and the level of services that we provide. However, we have been able to redesign some of our services and I think some of the redesign has been quite creative and faces the 21st century challenges that we have. We have looked at the way that we deliver services, for instance, in adults and communities and take the opportunity to personalise them a lot more and provide what individuals want rather than the package that might be perceived. In arriving at this budget, we have also been aware of financial pressures that our local taxpayers suffer and we have taken that into account. And with the government's support, we are pleased to announce that we will be there will be a nil council tax increase for the year 2011-12. This follows successive years under this administration of underinflationary increases over the past seven years. Uh, we are very proud of this, and in spite of these uh, modest uh, increases, we have still been able to make significant savings and invest in our caring services over that period of time. In arriving at the savings that we're required to make this year, which is some 200 million out of the 300 million we're required to make over the next three to four years, we have looked first at our, the supply of our back office services and we have made significant savings in that area and improved our efficiencies. Local residents will see little change as a result of that in the services that they receive. Frontline services have been redesigned and they've been redesigned targeting the more vulnerable in society and the needs generally of our residents. And we, we are proud of the work that has been done in that area. In setting this budget, we have also had to look more closely at successive years than previously. And so the budgets for 2012-13 and 2013-14 have been taken a stage further than they have been normally at this stage. We have a history of looking forward uh, for long-term financial planning. Uh, this is an extension of that process and the, those two detailed years uh, are part of that, but also we have looked at our long-term financial future over the next 10 years and the anticipated needs of our residents. The budget that is provided takes all those facts into account and we believe provides rounded services to the citizens of Birmingham